Let's get into the meat of the show and that is our first top story, the Asus ROG Flow Z13. It's a tablet, it's a gaming laptop, it's a 2-in-1, 12mm thin, one of the thinnest tablets ever yet. Look at the kind of specs, 14 core Intel core processor in there, optional NVIDIA Geoforce RTX 3050 GPU. It's got a lot of great specs including 1 terabyte of storage, 13.4 inches screen, 1610 format, 500 nits brightness. Now it is a little big, you know, weighs about 1.8 kg without the keyboard, 1.52 kgs with the keyboard. But other than that, I think I really, really like it. Uh, everything that this one can do is really fantastic. The RGB lighting, the two cameras on it, front facing 720p webcam for calls, back facing 8 megapixel snapper. But do remember, you're not really going to use a tablet for photography. What you will use it is for gaming. But do remember, this is expensive stuff. 1,36,990 is the starter price for this. What happens when a brand is passionate about technology and driven by innovation? I think you can find the answer in the new Asus ROG Flow Z13. That's basically a gaming tablet with top-of-the-line specs and a detachable keyboard for typing and protection. This tablet is truly the talk of gamer clans and we are here to determine if it truly matches the word on the street. From the first time you lay your eyes on it, you know how different this device is. The back of the tablet is matte black. There are small vents all over that suck in the air for cooling. A transparent glass shows the insides of the tablet illuminated with RGB. Plus, there are small little ROG related Easter eggs all over. The lower half of the back has a metal stand with a solid hinge. And for the device, it's a top heavy tablet which means holding it and using it as a tablet is a bit uncomfortable. As the Flow Z13 weighs 1.18 kg but with the keyboard, it weighs 1.52 kgs. The vents on all sides throw out the air to maintain the airflow. And along with the vents are a small number of ports. A USB-A port, an audio jack on the right side, along with a fingerprint scanner and volume rocker. A USB-C Thunderbolt 4 port on the left side, along with a port to connect the external GPU, covered with a rubber flap. The keyboard that comes with the Z13 is covered with a soft touch material that is quick to pick up dust. But as you would expect from a gaming device, the keyboard will satisfy your RGB needs. The typing experience is great for the most part, even though there is some flex in the keyboard. The trackpad is small, but extremely precise and smooth. Up front, you will find a 13.6 inch 1080p panel with a 120Hz refresh rate. The brightness tops out at 455 nits and the bezels are close to minimal. It is not groundbreaking by any means, but it is still impressive. Be it watching content or playing games, the experience remains delightful. And for the speakers, they are adequate. They offer a good amount of details with plenty of volume, but as expected, depth is where they suffer. But the internals of this tablet are just a completely different story. It comes with a 12th gen Intel i9 12900H CPU coupled with the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050Ti and a 1TB SSD along with 16GB LPDDR5 make for some ultra fast memory. So when it comes to meager and normal tasks, they hardly are a challenge for the laptop. As with gaming, while the CPU is more than powerful, the 3050Ti will only manage to give you around 60 FPS with medium to high settings. That out of a device this small is still great. When you add the XG Mobile external GPU to the mix, things take a huge jump. The XG Mobile adds the might of an RTX 3080, which takes your experience up a notch. In our experience, every game topped out the 120 FPS. The display is capable of at maxed out settings. And along with the external GPU also adds a bunch of ports, all while charging the tablet. So if you want to connect the tablet to a bigger display and add better accessories, this is possible with the addition of XG Mobile. But with all this, do not expect the battery life to be any good. As with light to average use, the battery lasts for only about 5 to 6 hours. 
The Rogue Flow Z13 is truly an interesting product. It manages to get a lot of the aspects right, even with some costs involved. The price starts at Rs 1,36,990 for the basic model, but the variant we tested was at Rs 1,81,990. While it makes a lot of sense if you use it for creating content, for the portability and power it offers, it makes little sense if you are considering it as a gaming device. For gaming, the only way it will make sense is with the XG Mobile. And at the price, if you are looking for a gaming device that is still extremely powerful and also has the versatility of a tablet, the Flow Z13 should make a great choice.